Look who's back together! <laughs> we are leaving the airport and heading to the city. Fun stuff up ahead. <laughs> We're heading to the city, to the Plaza Hotel, to have high tea with the princess herself. Very excited. I'm just excited to eat. I do. You don't. I, I enjoy it. Yeah. I just pay when it your inconvenience. But I will say when I don't have my luggage, it's totally different. Oh, like yeah. this is different. If I had my luggage, I'd probably be crying right now. this leather puffer jacket that I was coincidentally googling last night and they have one here. The sale at Zara was a little overwhelming. I met up with Samantha at a different store. I opted against that cute leather puffer jacket. I really wanted to get it but it was a size small. I'm quite petite so the small it was a crop jacket. It fit me like a regular jacket, so it was very baggy. I was very sad about it. It was the last one, and online they don't have any more. But yeah, now I'm waiting for Samantha. She's trying on a few things, and then we head to our appointment. Reservation. We get Samantha in her newly bought dress. She looks glamorous. It's a very adult, uh, sophisticated, look more I love than I've ever done. Plaza, eat your heart out. <laughs> We're at, um, I think St. Patrick's, but there's, there's a cute little wedding going on. But if the groom has any, uh, friends, this looks like a wedding we can afford. Whoa! So pretty. the vegan afternoon tea even though it's like four o'clock in the afternoon this is our dinner it's our breakfast lunch, breakfast lunch and dinner three meals in one we haven't had anything i'm starting the day off with champagne and i'm feeling it i'm a little buzz right now I'm a little twirly <laughs> Mango, pineapple. It almost tastes like a, a Chabana tea that I was obsessed with. Mm -hmm. And what do you think so far? Oh, I'm living right now. <laughs> My best life. <laughs> wow. Wow. Tomato, onions. So, almost like a pico. Yeah on some kind of yellow bread. Mmm, yeah. yeah. It's giving a little south of the border vibes. A little Tex 
snacks. Mm. Amazing. I'm so glad the food is good for how expensive it is. Mm -hmm. I was really worried that I would be like, you know, but oh no. my god. This now I'm like, I'm still going to be hungry after this because it's so good and a lot more. Another round, please. As I drop I say, everything. The are fake. You can just show them. Yeah. Okay, this one is. It's like cucumber. Wait, is there jalapeno? Zucchini. Pepper. I feel like there's a mushroom in mine. Okay. Not my fave. Asparagus. Asparagus. It's is that what I said? It's cream cheese and you said zucchini. Mm. Which there might also be zucchini on here. I mean, it's good. I actually really like it. The other one was. Yeah. But this one's really good too. This is mm. if it I could do without the peppers. I'm not a pepper person. Mm. Mm. Mine's very mushroomy though. Mm -hmm. I know. Maybe we should have straight out shit. I think it's the same. Well, I mean yours might not have had a big mine had a big chunk of mushroom in it. Mm -hmm. I wanna save the other scone, but I also it gets hard if you wait oh, no, too I think long. I'm also because the scone tastes really good with warm thick tea. Would I be putting this much um, whatever this is on there? Probably not. So you're you know better... what though, Yola? We for $118, girl, you you put it all on there. You're better than me. You're using a spoon to shovel it on. <laughs> yeah, but I think it's my teaspoon, so I feel like manners wise, it's incorrect. I'm not even sure if it's tomato. Oh, it's a little jelly. Okay. Yeah, I wonder what it is on a crisp cracker. Of some Mine kind. just fell off. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put all the fixings back on. Am I gonna eat it? Oh, I'm squishing mine. Uh huh. Mmm. Artichoke. Huh? I don't even know. Good. Not at all. Not at all what I expected. No. We thought it was a tomato. And I thought the jelly would freak me out a lot more than it did. But the texture is not that weird. Come on, not even put audio over this. Is she made an appropriate palate cleanse for me? It's like a jam with like, like a, a cake, cake yeah. on the bottom. Wow, with a gold plate. It's literally like a berry cake. Mm -hmm. I feel like I could have taken some of that and put it on my stove. stove. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna eat this because I know you won't. Go for it. I want to hear the review. It's like a chocolate roll with coconut whip and coconut shavings. Like you a, don't look impressed. As a cooking side, I don't like how um, the chocolate shell, it was like slightly lifted, so it like Ooh, yeah. got in between my teeth. Yeah. The cookie is nice. Banana. Yeah. Banana's good. Yeah, I think it's a, a banana cream pie with coconut. Oh, I bet you that's it. How are you doing so far? Very wonderful. Great. Thank you. Thank you. So we're almost done with our snacklings. We're still hungry. Very expensive snack. Our very expensive snack, and we're still hungry. So we already decided we're gonna have a full actual meal after this meal. Because that's just the type of people we are. We girls need food. We need food. And we don't know what type of champagne we're drinking.
jelly. I can't get into it. It's like a cross between a mousse and a jelly. Mmm. It's like Earl Grey. This is the Earl Grey. Wow. Wow. It's like an Earl Grey mousse, but like a little bit. Like a French vanilla Earl Grey. Wow. That's delicious. Wow. I want to like bathe in this. I would like to sleep in this. It just You're telling me. me. You're telling me. It just now hit me hard. I need this recipe. We need to look at the menu later and figure out what this is. I bet there is a recipe on there. Mm. So far, my favorite things are the scones. The, um, basically pico salsa sandwich, the Earl Grey pastry. I don't know. What about you? What's your favorite? My absolute favorite was the first sandwich. Meal. Yeah, the little pico, yeah, I'm pico avocado. I'm definitely more savory than sweet person, but the first scone we had with the berry, with the berry, that scone, and I'm not big because scones are so heavy. So yeah. Typically, I'm not like a huge scone fan. I love that. Those are probably my two. And they made the scone so nice because usually after like three minutes, it's like hard. Yeah. But that one was still soft. So Even when we came back at like ten minutes after, the bottom was a little bit more crisp. But this is like a pistachio. Definitely a nut situation. Chocolate. Ooh. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Oh. It has like a, a pistachio ganache. Not a big nut fan. Not, not so for favorite. me, this is probably like. I mean, it's like nuts. It's a good one. This last one is like pita bread, hummus looking, chick chickpea, microgreens. Microgreens. You have to smell everything. Mm. 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 This one's bomb. Whoa. The hummus is like perfectly like thick, like whipped. And these are roasted chickpeas. Oh, you wouldn't even have had taste of the chickpea, mm -hmm. did you? Yeah. Yeah. This is my new favorite one. The hummus, mm -hmm. I need the recipe and It gets better when you get to the pizza sauce. Mm. There's like a pizza sauce situation there. Wow. wow. I'm so happy. I'm very happy. I would do this again if someone else paid for it. I would also do this again if someone else paid for it. Because I'm such a fatty, I'm gonna eat all the things that Samantha did not eat. But also, you're just a good Samaritan who's getting our money's worth from the tea service. Mm -hmm. So earlier, I found a cute Eloise mailbox, and inside of our bill is the postcard. So pretty cute. Very elegant. I'm pretty sure this is how it looked back in the heyday, and now we show up looking like this. Champagne is not included in the $118. It's an added $30 per glass. Wait, tell the people how much was the champagne? $30, not included. 